everybody, it's the idiot right here. I figured I'd give you an update. This is what the fairing looked like, nice and shiny. And I decided to sand it down, use 400 grit sandpaper, in about half an hour, 45 minutes. As you can see, it's ready to be primed and painted. Now I'm just waiting on the paint to show up and hopefully I'll have an updated video in a few days. While I'm waiting for the paint to show up, I decided to try to build some brackets. I decided to use these shelves, that's what the bracket was. I'm going to chop them down. That way I can fit it on my bike where the fairing mount should mount to the bike. With one of the placements of where the original hole was, I should be able to take off my blinkers and it should mount up right in the bottom. And towards the top, I'm going to use a uh, hose clamp to kind of secure it in place. These are the threads that it's going to thread into as opposed to having a bolt sticking out of the side of the forks. That way if I ever do take off that fairing, it won't look near as bad. At least that's the plan. As you can see here, I've trimmed it down because there's a tab that stops it. I have it fairly close to where it lines up actually pretty good. I had to drill out the bottom hole which is right where that su uh, support brace was making the A shape on the actual frame itself. With any luck I can mount that to the frame. I'm going to have to drill this out a little bit bigger so they'll slide up behind those brackets. That's the plan. Oh yeah, there's one more thing. On this actual bracket, right in that corner is where all my cabling off my handlebars runs. And I'm afraid where it's gonna set, it's gonna be smashing them. So I have to take a grinder and grind out a curb and smooth it out and probably put like a rubber garment in there. That way I don't cut any wiring whenever I turn left and right. 